in Pillow Beach Pump Traders. Thank you for joining us for our initial due diligence video on Rivian Automotive Incorporated, ticker symbol RIVN. Uh, we'll go through our uh, typical initial due diligence, look at Rivian Automotive, look at the stock, and stick around to the end of the video, and we'll draw our conclusions if uh, based on our current due diligence. This due diligence video uh, was done in response to a request by one of our Discord members and our value, valued Patreon members. Speculation asked, what do we think about Rivian? Um, and at the time, as I stated, I had not looked at or considered Rivian Automotive as it was. Okay, let's take a quick look at uh, Rivian's homepage. Uh, it's rivian.com. I'll put the link in the description box below. Uh, we can see, you know, they've got two two main models, complete gear shop, etc. We see a picture of one of their vehicles. Uh, we see, you know, they're stressing the the uh, green nature of their EV vehicles. We can see their truck and their SUV. R1T priced at about 675k. Uh, their SUV style uh, R1S is about 72.5. So, you know, pretty expensive vehicles. Uh, you see, you can reserve right now. Uh, again, they're stressing, um, you know, their the green nature, climate control of EV, etc. Some some service notes some stories, etc. If we look a little bit at their company, we can see they have, you know, a reasonable social media presence. They've got some career stuff. They have an investor page, which is appropriate. So if we look a little bit at their company page, again, they're stressing climate, future, little bit about how they operate again a future thing diverse workforce active allies our standard due diligence for rivian automotive ticker symbol rivn in chart mill i'll leave the direct link to this um, profile of rivian and chart mill in the description box below we take a quick look at their overview of ratings. We can see their technical analysis rating is, is average, 2.5 out of 5. Their setup currently is a little below average, 2 out of 5. Uh, if we take a quick look at the chart, the overview here, we'll dig into more detail in a minute. Uh, but we can see Rivian has make, made a swung up. It's uh, broken above its moving average. It's trending up as now as of uh, August 16th. So we'll take a look in more detail at the chart in a minute. See the fundamental analysis is uh, generally uh, relatively poor, 1.5 out of 5. Valuation is very poor. Uh, growth is 2 out of 5. Uh, health is uh, positive, 4 out of 5. Uh, they don't pay a dividend, and profitability is extremely poor at zero. See a little bit about their market cap. Uh, obviously, their PE is not applicable because they're not profitable. If, we, if you're not familiar with Rivian, if we look at uh, their description of their profile here in Chart Mill, it says they engage in the design, development, and manufacture of uh, category defining electric vehicles and accessories are in California. Okay, if we start, uh, if we look at the stock chart uh, tab in Chart Mill for Rivian, R I V N, we look at the daily chart. We can see uh, Rivian recently kind of uh, reached a support level, a uh, local bottom, bounced up, broke through its. 50-day uh, simple moving average is trending upward. So again, it looks like a nice uh, swing. It bottomed, it sw swung up, it's trending upward. It's above its moving average. If we zoom, 
Okay, let's look at the technical analysis in chart mill for Rivian Automotive, ticker symbol RIVN. Again, we can see the overall technical rating is 5 out of 10, so just average. We can see short-term trend is positive. It's been trading positively. Got average volume, which is good. If we look at the support and resistance, See, there's a support zone from 36.93 to 37.27. Uh, we see the overall setup rating is only 4 out of 10, so the setup is a little uh, below average. See, there's a resistance zone from 38.91 to 38.96. And we can see. Okay, if we look at the fundamental analysis tab for Rivian in Chart Mill. We can see overall their fundamental rating is uh, relatively poor, 3 out of 10. Uh, it states it has a great financial health rating, but its profitability evaluates not so good. It's quite expensive, so we can see the health is very positive. Valuation is poor. Growth is as moderate. Profitability is extremely poor. So again, negative profitability, their return on assets is poor, their profit margin is poor. So again, profitability is very poor. Um, Petrosky is six, it's low. So we see also their valuation is very poor. Price earnings negative because they're not profitable. Their forward price earnings is negative, so there's no expectation of them being profitable. Price to books okay. Uh, their growth is a little below average, four out of ten. Uh, will show uh, strong growth for the next four years in revenue. They're saying very, you know, very high growth in the next five years. Uh, near term, it's uh, neutral and EPS. Okay, if we look at the analyst ratings for Rivian Automotive. In chart mill, we can see it's got a 79% buy consensus, so very positive analyst estimates. It's analyzed by 24 analysts, so it's got good coverage. Uh, we can see that the median price target is 56, so it's got 50% 50, 50 upside. Uh, we see no recent downgrades, etc. Looks uh, neutral. Okay, so it's it's got good coverage. And again, here they say the mean. Okay, if we look at the ownership structure for Rivian in chart mill, we can see the majority, 66% is institutional, very small percentage of insiders, and then the other 34% is uh, retail, public. And we can see the institutional ownership hasn't changed much. Uh, there's some change in insider diligence for Rivian, Rivian Automotive, ticker symbol RIVN, and Weeble. I'm on the stock screen on the online browser version of Weeble. Uh, we can again see the stock chart, so we can see it kind of bottomed out in this 1925 area. It's been trending upward. This is a one-year look at uh, the chart for Rivian. Uh, we see their most recent er earnings was on uh, August 11th. Uh, we'll talk about some of the things we heard uh, coming out of that earnings. Again, in Weeble, it's uh, nice. You can pop up this tab. You can see the recent news. Uh, we see uh, Ray Dalio took a stake in uh, Rivian, David on Einhorn. So you've got some big... Uh, Big uh, stock uh, investors, etc., have taken positions. So I, I like to look at the financials in particular, the nice graphical view in Weeble. So we can see their income. It kind of trended up, bottomed in Q3 of 21, trended up, been pretty flat, uh, close to expectations. Balance sheet, uh, you know, is pretty flat and pretty close to zero. Again, cash flow went up a little bit. It's been very flat. Look at their income statement. Again, it was pretty negative in Q4 of 21. Bounced back up. It's still negative. 
revenue has been increasing. Their operating income, again, kind of bottomed. Again, these probably all correspond to that bottom that we saw in the chart is in Q421. Uh, their operating income bottomed. It's bounced back up. It is still negative. Balance sheet. Looks like their debt to assets uh, improving uh, or de decreasing. Their debt's increasing a little bit. And again, cash flow is very negative in uh, Q4. Just a quick reminder that as of the recording of this video on August 16th, Weeble's currently offering up to 12 free stocks if you open and fund a new account in Weeble. This is the most number of free stocks I've seen Weeble uh, offer. I don't know how long this offer will last, but if you're not already using Weeble, here's an opportunity to get 12 free stocks. You can find our affiliate link to Weeble in the description box below on the About page on our YouTube channel uh, in the link section. Okay, if we do our due diligence for Rivian automotive in finviz and i'll leave the direct link to this profile for rivian automotive uh, in finviz in the description box below we can see their uh, daily chart it's showing you know this uh, bounce off of this uh, trend line here and then a slow increase where it uh, got above its moving averages we can see this pivot point at around 60 uh, so it's slowly approaching that. That would be a resistance level around 60. If we take a quick look at their weekly chart, again, we can see that bottom turn up. It's broken that uh, moving average, so that's positive. Again, since it's got very little history, again, we see that bottoming and, and turning up. So it's made a nice swing um, recently. If we look at some of the metrics, we can see they're losing a ton of money. They do have sales, but they're again, they're losing a ton of money. Uh, sentiments uh, neutral. Uh, they don't have a terrible amount of debt. Again, their price to sales is very high. Um, got, you know, small instit insider ownership. Uh, we see the float uh, shares outstanding. Well, it's got a, almost a billion, 900 million shares, so pretty large. Short quotes only 6%. We see the range. See, it's got a, lo a lot of news. We'll see if there's any positive negatives offhand. It's a nice thing about uh, FinBiz. You can see the green positive, uh, notable positive, or red notable negative. Uh, so, yeah, the, the Imp Inflation Reduction Act, there's noting that as a positive for them. Tax credits for EVs, again, positive. Uh, so, those are subsidies. And again, you can see a description here of uh, Rivian, sells electric vehicles, five passenger pickup trucks, sport utilities. It's got a commercial vehicle platform for delivery vans. They're in collaboration with Amazon. So again, that's very positive. Uh, it sells its products directly to consumers. Okay, let's do our due diligence of Rivian Automotive, ticker symbol RIVN on Seeking Alpha. I'll put the direct link to this profile in Seeking Alpha for Rivian in the description box below. We see a quick overview of the chart. Again, descending, bouncing, and trending upward. Uh, quick look at some of the news. Uh, it looks like they had solid results in August, so that uh, can uh, attribute to their uh, increase. Uh, recently, there's somebody, it's uh, Rivian's their favorite EV company. Ray Dalio, David Ern Einhorn increased their stakes in Rivian. So again, this is very recent. So they've got, you know, some big backers. So again, the, the near-term news looks positive. Uh, their rating summary from Seeking Alpha authors is whole, Wall Street's buy. Again, you can get information on their profile. Uh, we see the revenue, uh, quarterly revenue has been increasing nicely. 
we look at their annual revenue again looks like it's showing an increase their EPS quarterly EPS looked like it was improving a little bit uh, and then looks like it's relatively stable annually again looks like it's uh, improving slightly valuation again they're relatively new so there's a lot of uh, metrics that are are not filled in yet return on equity return on assets is negative they've got a market cap of 34 billion they've got 1.7 billion in debt and here's a nice figure that we've been looking for is their cash position so they've got almost 15 billion in cash so in a minute we'll see what their cash burn rate is hopefully so we see they've got a lot of volume a lot of trading volume 17 million in volume so it's a heavily traded stock we see in uh, their ownership structure again 48 percent in Okay, so based on all of this initial due diligence on Rivian Automotive, ticker symbol RIVN, uh, what's our conclusions as to whether Rivian is a stock to buy now? Well, some additional considerations at this point in time in August of 2022, is there an EV company um, and we're going into a recession. They recently uh, commented, I heard a comment in one of their earnings reports that they had some supply constraints uh, and also it sounded like some labor constraints, which was constraining their ability to uh, ramp up production to meet their p potential sales. Uh, so that, that's a bit of a negative. Um, on a positive, they do have a backing in large orders from Amazon, so that's a very positive. Uh, they have, you know, a good a pile of cash, a good war chest of cash, so they should be able to survive a recession. Um, also, again, if we revisit some of the... Uh, the content of this video was produced by Beach Bum Trading. We hope you will choose to also join us in the Beach Bum Trading community and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Visit us at our homepage at beachbumtrading.com, the bum without the U. Similarly on Twitter, Beachbum Trading, bum without the U. On Facebook and in our Beachbum Trading Facebook group. Please follow us on Pinterest and on Instagram. All of the links to our social media sites will be included in the description box below. And we hope you will choose to subscribe to our Beachbum Trading YouTube channel and follow us on social media. Thank you. We also cordially want to invite you to our new Beach Bum Trading Community Discord server where we can have discussions on all topics related to trading, success in trading, investing, etc. You can see uh, alerts when we make trades, changes to our watch list, etc. So again, please join us in the new Beach Bump Trading Community Discord server. You should be able to find a link in the description box below. You can also find a link in the social media category on our webpage, beachbumptrading.com, without the bum without the U, and also in the link section on the about page of our YouTube channel, etc. So again, we look forward to seeing you in the Beach Bump Trading Community Discord server soon. Wave and say hello. Beach Bump Trading also now has a site on Patreon. If you are willing and able to help support our efforts to uh, produce all the content and help you achieve the financial freedom you want and deserve to be able to leave, live the Beach Bump lifestyle or any other kind of lifestyle you would like and you're willing and able to help support our efforts in these regards so uh, we hope you'll choose to visit our patreon page uh, you can get access to our new uh, beast bump trading community discord server which is currently under construction but you will get access to the discord server by supporting us through patreon again this is all currently under construction, but you can see 
we just have the default uh, levels, membership levels, but again, each level allows support, uh, allows access to our Discord. Um, we're also posting our trade um, trade positions initially in our Discord. And again, we greatly appreciate uh, any support that you're willing and able to provide. So thank you for your consideration. Thank you again for watching our video. We hope that you liked it. If so, please smash the like button. Give us a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, please consider subscribing to our Beach Bum Trading YouTube channel. Please share this video with your fellow traders and friends. And please give us your feedback and any recommendations for improvement in the comment section below. And let us know what else we can do to help you in your trading career. Thank you again. Good luck and have a great trading day. If you like this video, we hope you will choose to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the box in the upper left hand corner. You can watch another video like this by clicking on the box in the lower right hand corner. And we have a whole playlist of videos like this that you can access via the box in the upper right hand corner. Our latest video is available in the box in the lower left hand corner. We hope you like this and have a great day.